All right, so I'm in the shop working today and an idea hit me. Sometimes ideas just smack me upside the head. I'm working on this, I think it's a 1960 turquoise and white slider window. I said that's a really beautiful little car, but I had an idea that I wanted to share with I said it, enthusiasts. I've been talking about the rear end relocation kit on a couple of my videos. And if you look in there, I'm shining my light on the drive line. Let's see if I can rotate the wheel here with the light on it so you can see the guibos, how they flex. I'm just going to get the camera in there a little closer. Every time the drive line rotates there, it's flexing in and out because that drive line is at an angle. Now, from this point of view, it looks pretty straight. Let's go to the other side and I'll show you what I mean. Okay, so what we're doing is we're looking up there. I'm gonna hold this with my armpit and spin the wheel again. See the angle of that drive line? It's all cattywampus. And every time the transmission output shaft turns, it's got to fight those guibos in a pinch, see there, because of that misalignment. So keep that in mind. We're going to go over to this car over here, which has the relocation kit, which the axle has been moved toward the engine. Heavy duty guibos installed, and you can see already the drive line, if I can get my light there, is in perfect alignment. There's no binding, no twisting. It just rolls nice and smooth. That equates to less resistance, which in an Isetta equates to more power. So let's now look at it from this side. See how the drive line is nice and straight? It's completely straight from the output shaft, the transmission, over to the input shaft of the, of the chain case. If I can turn that from here, I'm not sure if I can. I'm going to hold that up there. I'm going to reach over here and grab this. See, no binding. No uh, angled drive line. It's really nice. Just turns nice and smooth. So luckily this car that has the relocation kit is my car. <laughs> and I'll be enjoying the benefits of that. But as you can see, that makes for a nice little upgrade. Comes with a new little link. That end link right there I'm shining my light on is shorter by an inch. And the springs have been drilled. You can see the springs hang out there, right, right here. See, there's an inch there. That's where the bolt used, to, where this bolt used to go through to bring that rear axle a little closer and give us that one inch to line up that drive line. It makes good sense for our little I set of friends. They're all over the place. There and there. All right, have a great day. I hope that uh, helped you understand how that relocation kit works that I said a dude sells. I think it's pretty neat. It's going to work out great. Thank you for watching.